accomplishments and do a little recap. We will also have a few guest speakers and give out awards to those exceptional members that we have recognized throughout the year. Also, we will be saying goodbye to our graduating senior officers while also bringing in some new officers for the 2016-2017 year. And finally, we will have cake. So to introduce our guest speakers, first, our not speakers, sorry, <laughs> our uh, special guests. So first we have Mr. Bartell. Mr. Boy. Mr. Crawford. Mrs. Crawford. how good leaders should be and how 
I can make friends and learn and cooperate better as a leader myself. And now I'll hand it off to the other Rana Kennedy. So as Karthik mentioned, RALA stands for Rotary Youth Leadership Awards. And I thought that RALA was a really unique learning experience. You know, it's not your average leadership camp. It's not just you go there, they teach you how to lead your school, and then you're gone. It's more than that. It's more about self-awareness. It's more about looking inside yourself and your personal best way to lead others. So at RALA, there were many different guest speakers. And one of my favorite guest speakers at RALA was Rick Metzger. And he was a former captain of the United States powerlifting team. And he gave this really amazing lecture about leadership style. Um, he made it really interactive. It helped us discover our own leadership style. And there were many different leadership styles that uh, he talked about. And I discovered I was more of a visionary leader. And Rick describes that as someone who uh, moves people towards a common goal and helps them avoid consequences. Also, at Ryla, it was also a great opportunity to step out of my comfort zone in many aspects. That activities such as group discussions, meeting new people, team building activities, and even more. Overall, I thought that Ryla was a really invaluable experience, and, and I highly encourage you guys to apply next year. Hi guys, my name is Cynthia Mann, and I'm currently a junior at Mady's High School. To start off, I want to say that my experience at Ryla, I would give it a 10 out of 10. I thought it was amazing, and I'd highly advise everybody in this room that's not graduating to definitely sign up and submit an application for it, because it's going to be worthwhile. First of all, I'd like to start off by saying that Ryla taught me three main experiences about leadership that I took home and I used for uh, the rest of my school year, and I thought it was very successful. First of all, it taught me communication. What I learned at Ryla was not how to only communicate with my peers, but how to communicate with my teachers and my parents and all of the adults and other generations that I'm going to have to communicate with uh, in the outside world when I start like doing actual jobs and writing applications. And I thought that was really important because it actually taught you life values. Second off, um, what I learned at Ryla was structure and organization. And I think that's really important, especially if you're going to be in a leadership, a leadership position when you're older. Structure and organization teaches you that you're going to have a lot of like multiple tasks on you if you're a leader. And second off, it, te uh, it te teaches you that you're going to have high expectations if you're a leader and you need to know how to deal with both of them. Third off, Ryla taught me about inspiration and I thought this was the most important aspect of what I learned. Uh, at Ryla, I met this uh, young man named Joshua and he taught me that at the age of four, he opened up his own organization and he is currently traveling the world, um, or like traveling the United States, uh, expanding it, and through perseverance and dedication, he's actually making a nationwide nonprofit organization that helps feed uh, poor, uh, like homeless people among the United States, and I thought that was so important, and um, I thought that was really inspirational, and I brought that back with me to Mainies, and I'm currently working on um, a project with my teacher to bring Joshua's heart to Mainies. Because it 
all matters, all that matters is what you think you're capable of doing. So that's one big thing that I took out of the Rio experience. And another thing was that Mr. Metzger handed out roses and teddy bears to a couple of people. And he asked us to raise our hand if we received a rose in the past week. And nobody raised their hand. Then he asked, how many of you have received a rose in the past month? Nobody raised their hand again. And then he asked, raise your hand if you haven't received a rose in the past month. Everybody raised their hand, including me. And I was sitting in the far corner of the room, and he decided to call me up in front. And I definitely had no idea what was coming my way. But when he finally did call me up, and when I came up, he gave me a rose and gave me a hug and said, Hazel, I know you're going to be successful, and I know you have the proper leadership skills to be whatever you want to be in life. Here's a rose. And that was really inspirational to me because it taught me that giving one small thing to someone, even if you don't know them, and saying a couple of nice things really can have an impact on not just their day, but maybe their, their life. And um, we also took a detailed personality test the next day in which we learned different leadership skills and we learned what type of leader we are, as well as certain personality characteristics. And so we were actually able to apply those when we did team bonding the, um, the day after. And we were able to apply everything that we learned by distinguishing certain characteristics um, of people in our groups. So overall, I think Rila was definitely a great experience. And as many of them said, I definitely recommend that everyone else applies next year because it really will have an impact on you. And not just um, it's not just a three-day activity that will have that will be a great experience, but it will actually impact you and your decisions in the future. Um, so Rotary Interact this year at Vandy has had tons of highlights, as you guys know. You guys have participated greatly, and we thank you for that every day. But um, so, so we put together a showcase video just to put together all the highlights that we saw you guys accomplish. And um, to, again, extend a thank you from the Rotary.